It's Friday night. We're heading into the weekend, and it was a warm Friday, especially warm for the first week of January. Yes, we were tying a record here in Salt Lake today, close to 60 degrees. 58 was our high, and our next storm has arrived. So that was the warm before this very weak storm moves through. Right now, we are seeing some light to moderate snowfall through Logan Canyon up towards Bear Lake. Logan, Cache County, seeing some areas of rainfall. Once you get down Sardine towards Brigham City, things are still just somewhat spotty and very light for precipitation, but this is expected to fill in over the next couple of hours. We could have a few hours of moderate to heavy snowfall up in the mountains. So our forecast snow totals taking you through tomorrow night. We could see several inches of snow up in the mountains. It's just not very likely that we end up seeing a whole lot here in the valleys. So we're mainly looking at about three to seven inches of snow for the Cottonwood Canyons. Could have slick conditions at times tonight. Winter driving will be possible for our mountain passes and we have that chance for snow all the way down to the mountains just close to Beaver, north of Circleville and the Capitol Reef area, just west of there. St. George, you're close to 60 degrees for Saturday and Sunday, so what we had here in Salt Lake today, that's what St. George will continue to get through the next week. If you work from home and you've got time, hey, head down south because we have some valley inversions returning here across northern Utah. Salt Lake City in our Super 7-Day forecast, let's go ahead and go a little more in-depth in each day for you. Saturday, tomorrow here in Salt Lake, our temperatures will hang in the 30s for pretty much all afternoon. So when you wake up first thing tomorrow morning, you want to go for a walk and you're like, eh, kind of cold. Maybe I'll wait till the afternoon. Guess what? It's not going to be too much warmer tomorrow afternoon. So you can go out for that walk anytime you want. On Sunday, if you're going to go for a hike or you're going to do some skiing, you're going to have a really chilly start to your morning on Sunday. At 8 a.m. up in the mountains, 10 degrees. By lunchtime, though, closer to 20 degrees. Here in Salt Lake, we're close to 40 degrees on Sunday. We head into Monday, 37. By Tuesday, 38 degrees here in Salt Lake City, and we're going to end up with some temperatures for you that are very consistent between storms. High pressure is going to take hold. As you can see, that chance of precipitation, our outlook over the next seven days brings us some widely scattered showers tomorrow and then some widely scattered showers possible towards the end of next week. So that means your top headlines here in Salt Lake City by next Wednesday. We're drying out. We have Average temperatures are just barely above average temperatures, and we have valley inversions that have returned. By next Thursday, we're looking at 39 degrees for a high. By next Friday, 38 here in Salt Lake. And our precipitation outlook for week two has us a bit drier in western Utah. Eastern Utah, normal precipitation heading into next weekend and the week after that. But temperatures very consistent with valley inversions returning here in Salt Lake City.